गुड मॉर्निंग माई डियर किड्स वेलकम बैक टू योर मैथ्स क्लास चिल्ड्रेन नाउ यू हैव टू सी द गिव एन वीडियो वेरी केयरफुली टू अंडरस्टैंड अबाउट द टूडेज टॉपिक लुक आई हैव अ जग फिल्ड विद वॉटर एंड एन एम टी ग्लास नाउ लेट्स पोर दिस वॉटर इन द ग्लास Look the water started overflowing and fell out of the glass hence we can say that the capacity of this jug is more than that of the glass that is the jug can hold more water than glass so children i think you understand today what we are going to learn so let us see so today we are going to learn about capacity so first thing will be what is capacity can you children tell me so let us see what is capacity the amount of liquid a container can hold is called its capacity now children can you tell me how to measure the capacity of anything so for this how to measure the capacity of anything we need standard units of capacity and that are liters and milliliters liters represented by small l and milliliter represented by ml now the next one is 1 liter is equal to 1000 milliliters and we can write the same in using short form now as you can know that liter is bigger unit used to measure the capacity of big things and milliliter is a smaller unit used to measure the capacity of small things now the next one is comparison of capacity based on shape and size now children look at the two different containers that i have taken and let us try to find out which has more capacity first there is a jug and this one one small bowl now looking at the shape and size let's find out which has more capacity as we can see that this bowl is small in size as compared to the jug that means this bowl will hold less water as compared to jug that's why we say that the jug has more capacity than the bowl now let us see one more example here i have this is one glass and here is one cup now if we compare these two things as you can see according to the shape and size cup is smaller than the glass so it has less capacity than glass so what we can say that the glass has more capacity than cup so according to the shape and size we can compare that which has more capacity and which has less capacity so hence we can say that the jug has more capacity among these containers and which will be the less yes this cup will hold the least water so we can say that the capacity of cup is least from the given container so now from the given example we know that every container has its own capacity and it might vary depending on the shape and size now let us recap so first thing we have learned about what is capacity that is the amount of a liquid a container can hold is called its capacity then the two standard units of capacity that are liters and milliliters then 1 liter is equal to 1000 milliliter next liter is bigger unit and milliliter is a smaller unit now children note down your homework so the first question is what is capacity and number 2 question is what are the standard units of capacity so children both the question you will write down in your maths copy and do it so that's all for today's class